Hey there, this is Heather with Two Blooms Lightroom Presets, and in this tutorial I am going to be demonstrating the Blessings Lightroom Preset and Brush Collection for Lightroom 4 and 5. So before we begin, I just wanted to say uh, a special thanks to Evie Claire Photography for providing all of the beautiful images I'm going to be showing you today. So we're going to begin. Um, I'm going to show you how to smooth out the skin and reduce any kind of complexions. This photograph is beautiful to begin with. Um, the lighting is really even and the skin tones are great. I will be using a preset just to kind of polish it up and then I'm going to show you how to get rid of this red skin. You can see how he is positioned. It's cutting off a little bit of the circulation so um, his little arm is red so I'm going to show you how to use um, the brush collection to make his skin look more uniform to the rest of his skin. So I'm going to start with a preset. Um, let's go up here. I'm going to use Whisper. Okay, so you can see how that just kind of brightened everything out. And with this preset collection, um, I created it to smooth out the skin, to brighten and uplift the mid-tones to make everything look bright and airy which is perfect for a newborn um, workflow. So after um, I use the preset I'm gonna come down here and sharpen it. And this might be too bright for you but we have a t you know a very wide variety of presets. I also like this too. But I'm gonna use Whisper for this particular photo. And after we did the preset, you can see the before and after, how it just made everything really bright. It evened out shadows and minor um, imperfections in the skin. So I'm going to just polish up the rest of his skin using the brushes because the presets aren't going to take away every single flaw, but they're going to do a pretty good job to start out with. So for this photo, I'm going to start off with... I have a lot of brushes, but I'm going to start off with the creamy skin complexion. And this is just going to give him a nice complexion um, to help balance out that redness. Now you can see that there's still a little bit more red, but I'm just doing this to add a little bit of color so when I take away that red, it'll have a nice creamy color to him. So after I am done with this brush, I click New. So I can select a new brush, and I'm going to come down here and choose Less Rosy Skin. This is also included, included in the newborn collection. And I'm just going to go over this part of his arm. As you can see, it's not really doing much at the moment, but I'm going to adjust, adjust it, the amount over here. I'm going to actually take it down, and as you can see as I'm taking it down, that redness is diminishing. I could take it all the way down but that's a little too yellow. So I think that right there is about right. Now for me this is a perfect newborn edit. I don't like um, babies and newborns to look um, absolutely perfect because they're not. But I'm going to choose a new brush and I'm just going to kind of go over his entire skin with a dodge brush just to brighten it up. Um, I will be adjusting this because this is a little bright. Dodging will also smooth out any imperfections as well. So if you don't want to go crazy with the brushes and the editing, um, just doing a little bit of dodging will be great. And I'm just doing this really quickly to demonstrate. I would normally take a little bit more time and zoom in. But after I'm done, I'm going to decrease the amount because I don't want it too bright. That's just perfect. So when I'm done, I'm going to just push done. And you can see the before and after just by using the preset. And just a couple of brushes, how this really polished up his skin and just made him look beautiful. 
And this is what I love about the collection, is that the presets and the brushes just work so flawlessly together. I'm going to show you one more using this photo. And her skin is pretty much the same way. There's not a lot of imperfections. Um, but I'll show you how the the presets and the brushes can work so beautifully together. So I'm going to choose you can see all of the variety. Let's do let's do lullaby for this one. And as you can see it just brightened everything up, took away a lot of the shadows so you get that nice even creamy skin which is a big a big trend in the newborn photography right now. Okay, so her skin looks pretty good, um, but I am going to do a brush on her skin. It's looking tinge yellow, um, so I have created the Goodbye Jaundice brush, which is great for babies, especially if they have a little bit of yellow skin or jaundice. And I'm just going to go over parts of her face that look a little yellow. And this is just a neutralizing brush, so it's just taking away the color pigments of the yellow, so you're going to have to adjust it if it's a little too much. So I'm going to down it a little bit. And that looks good to me. So I'm going to do one more brush. I'm going to hit New. And scroll down. And I'm going to choose my razor sharp details. I really like to use this brush on the, all the little details like the lips and the eyelids just to make those pop. You want the rest of your skin to be really smooth and creamy, but when you sharpen these areas, it really makes them pop. You can see her little lips are nice and sharp, but not too bad. And the rest of her skin looks nice and creamy and smooth. So you can see it just took a few minutes to edit those two photos using the preset and the brush collection. These presets and brushes are available for Lightroom 4 and 5. If you have any questions or concerns or comments, please visit our website at www.tubelooms.com. Thanks for stopping by.